the inaugural recipient of the Willem J. Kolf Award for Innovation and Exceptional Patient Care is Dr. Kwabena Entoso. I am originally from Ghana. Growing up uh, was difficult. We were uh, not well-to-do family, we were relatively poor, but we all worked hard. Everybody was uh, very dedicated. My mother uh, actually died after childbirth. Uh, and that was a very difficult process and difficult uh, you know, situation for me. Uh, so that sort of led me to believe that I could help people. I was about 13 years old when I decided that I think I would like to become a doctor and really tailored my hard work and education towards that goal. Dr. Intoso's clinical career speaks for itself. After completing his residency at Bronx Municipal Hospital as chief medical resident, he completed his fellowship in renal and electrolyte disorders at the Hospital of the University of Pennsylvania, where he has continued to teach, serve on academic committees, and currently serves as the medical director for Franklin Dialysis. The one individual who actually influenced me was my advisor in medical school, and he happened to be a nephrologist. And he was a very, very bright individual, very nice individual, and I observed his interaction with patients. Uh, and from that experience, I decided that uh, nephrology was going to be what uh, I wanted to do here. Dr. Intoso is truly committed to improving patient care. He is a very active investigator in clinical trials, as well as proactively educating minority populations about the impact of diabetes and the importance of kidney screenings. I met um, Dr. Natoso last year in 2013. Well, my mom, originally, she was diagnosed as a diabetic at 37 years old. She ended up having a diabetic coma, and as a result, they removed one of her kidneys. She was on dialysis for about five years, um, and she passed away in 2009 at 56 years old. If we would have met Dr. Natoso back in 2004, and Dr. Natoso was my mother's nephrologist, that I believe that she would have still possibly still been alive today. She probably would have took better care of her health and also would have considered being on the kidney transplant list. If I see a patient with kidney disease, chances are they have a family, whether it's a son, a daughter, sister, brother, who may also have kidney disease or who may have, who may be at risk for kidney disease and is not aware of it. So it's a total uh, family patient uh, care that I try to provide, uh, not just focus on that one patient. I'm just really excited about Dr. Natoso being presented uh, this award.